Hey guys, it's Gigi here with Kale and Bananas. I just want to show you uh, one of my workouts today. It's not like a regular workout. I change my workout just about every time. Um, but I'm fortunate enough to have a gym uh, at my house in my basement. So I'm just going to show you a little workout. Uh, first, I start off, I, I warm up on the elliptical machine. So let's head over there. Alright, so uh, that's my cardio for my warm up. And next, we're going to warm up the arms with uh, five minute arms. So, this is called five minute arms. It's just five minutes of uh, different exercises with your arms. I'm going to be using 10 pound weights. So, let's set a timer. I'm going to start off with shoulder press. I switch exercises every 30 seconds. So right now we're about halfway through shoulder press. I'm gonna do pull-ups next. These little pull-ups. I don't know if they actually have a real name. That's just what my trainer, Jason, and I call them. My goal is to bring your elbows as high up as you can. We're a little over halfway there. About 10 seconds left. Actually, <laughs> about five. And now triceps. This is just a warm up, so don't stress about reps. Just go your, get your body warmed up. Now arm curls. Arm curls are kind of a nice uh, break in between. Because after this I'm going to be going right into front arm raises. But like I said, not about the reps, just about getting warmed up. <laughs> he leaned forward with one foot. To the sides. My feet are a little over shoulder width apart. Try to get it up and over your head. These are called overhead reaches because you literally reach over your head. Five, four, three, two, and switch. And you just do both arms. Try to make these kind of rapid. And you can turn your wrist or not. Five, four, Three, two, one. I'm gonna do um, some cardio. I'm gonna do some um, high intensity interval training, HIIT, H I I T, uh, on the treadmill. 30 seconds run, 30 seconds walk. We're gonna do that for five minutes. All right, so I start off with just a nice, normal pace walk for 30 seconds. 
low incline. You can do an incline if you really want to, but I don't really prefer. Um, I like incline for other workouts, which I'll show you eventually. <laughs> All right, 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. I'm usually able to talk for the first one, <laughs> but not after five minutes. We're about halfway through the first run. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And just back down to that 3.2 pace. Walk it for 30 seconds. We're a minute in. Four to go. Three and a half, kind of. down in the basement. So now that that uh, lovely cardio is done, uh, we're gonna do some uh, bench press and some flies and some tricep overheads. So let's go. I'm gonna do 20. Uh, these are 15 pounds, so I'm doing 30 pounds. And we're gonna do 20 reps, do some flies, and we'll do three sets. Thirty tens. Now to the fifteens. Twenty of these big guys. <laughs> So that was the first set going up the stairs. And you should really feel the burn. And I'm feeling it. And then you gotta go again, work your way back down. I'm gonna do 30 of the 10s again. That's good. If you feel the burn, it means you're working. Okay. 
right now, it's 40 of these. My arms are tired now, but luckily these weights are light. If you don't feel the burn, it means you need to go up on your weights. So that's it for walking up and down the stairs of weights. And uh, what else do I wanna do? Let's do some legs. Let's do some lunges and squats again. <laughs> All right, we're gonna do some lunges and squats. I'm just gonna do 20 lunges, 20 squats. Lunges, no weights. Um, squats, I'll do with this bar. Let's do, I'm gonna do uh, 10 front and 10 back lunges, or forward and backward, whatever. I don't really know how people even hold these, but this is how I hold mine. Just gonna do 20. And I'm gonna do some push-ups, some uh, planks, mountain climbers, and then crunches, and that'll be it for today. Tomorrow's gonna be an intense workout, so gotta keep it a little bit lighter. 20. Actually, make it 25. do some mountain climbers, I'm gonna do 30. So my hair is a mess. Alrighty. So I'm sweating a little bit. Um, and this is a uh, Normally, a little workout cut a little bit short, but I'm just gonna do some crunches, be done for the day, and tomorrow it's gonna be a good workout, and I'll show you guys what I'm eating tomorrow too. So, you're eating, not eating. <laughs> I'm just gonna do 20 regular um, crunches to start.
All right, so that was just a little workout. Um, that was not a very big workout, not a very hard workout, but I'm still sweating. It's hot down here. It was a long day. Um, I do work out six or seven days a week. I don't really take a day off, per se. Sometimes I just lighten up the workout, um, and I make sure I change it up so it's not boring. So let's head upstairs. All right, guys, so uh, that was the end of my little workout there. Uh, we finished off with balance okay I have you in the uh, in the fruit bowl finish off with about 55 minutes in the workout uh, 330 active calories and total for the workout was 405 um, my heart rate right now is about a hundred oh never mind <laughs> 80 just went down uh, my average heart rate for the workout was about a hundred and that's that so now it's post-workout time I took off my glasses because I don't like how I look in them, but right now I'm blind without them. There we go. <laughs> um, so thank you guys for watching this. I don't know if this interested you at all, um, but if you like this or if you want to see other workouts or if you're looking for target areas, I was thinking about doing videos uh, specifically for different target areas. Back, the armpit area here, uh, biceps, triceps, legs. Uh, if you're looking for a cardio workout, a more weight-based workout, um, let me know. I do all kind of fun stuff all the time. Jason really does a lot of different things with me and inspires me every day. Um, so I'm gonna head to my post-workout shake, which if you're wondering what it is, it is my post-workout smoothie. Um, I don't even know if you want to call it a smoothie, maybe like a shake or just a drink really, um, is half a cup of Orgain's organic protein almond milk, one cup of water, two scoops of um, Sun Warriors chocolate. This is the Warrior Blend. I actually like the original one better. Um, it's a better protein boost. This is 100 calories for 16 grams, and the other one is 80 calories for 16 grams of protein. Uh, so it's just it's lower calorie and higher protein. Um, I do about a tablespoon of this. This is Nestle's Toll House uh, Pure 100% Cocoa. Uh, it's just one gram of protein and adds a little bit of chocolatiness to this. Since it's raw, it's a little gritty, but it's really good. Um, and sometimes, especially after um, I do weights, I put in a tablespoon, or a teaspoon rather, of cinnamon. Uh, it's anti-inflammatory, pretty good for you. And when I'm using this as a meal replacement, I include one large banana, or in this case, two small bananas. Uh, they're really good for you, like when they're spotty. Um, something about like the nutrients, I, I read it online, I'll include the link below, um, about spotty bananas versus like super not body, just yellow bananas or green. Uh, so that's really it. I'm going to go make my smoothie and thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't already. Like this video, share it on Facebook or Twitter, wherever you want to share it. Uh, and comment below if you have any questions, if you want to talk workout, if you have any uh, comments or suggestions for me, let me know. And I'll see you next time. Bye.